What's going on guys, it is St. Gatsby here bringing you a brand new video today. Today's going to be episode 2 in the Halo series, Oni Sword Base is the mission we're going to be playing. And if you guys are enjoying, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, let's get into it. But New Zealand is yeah. green. Advised, Kilo 3, 3, New Zealand's Kilo like 3, where they film like Lord of the Rings. LZ is too hot. Roger that. Dot, stand by to receive and respond. Yes, Commander. Coordinates received. Earth Initiate Earth. immediate course correction. The Office of Naval Intelligence Sword Base is presently under siege from the Corvette Glass Covenant vessel. Corvette? Due to the sensitive nature of this facility, use of orbital rounds has been for the moment prohibited. Regrettably, my efforts to obtain relevant data on enemy forces have been unsuccessful. However, current defensive forces are insufficient. Oni has requested Team Noble's direct intervention to help secure Sword Base. Sword Base. Alright, people. We're stuck with that ship for the time being. Let's focus on the hostile infantry. Give those troopers a hand. Those guys are Cat 6, you're out here. George Emil, you're next. Get prepped. Let's move, Lieutenant. <laughs> No, we all have DMs. Cat, six. Push back the attack on sword base. Find oh, out what we're dealing with. Yep. Spartans, hostiles north. Just like that. Yeah, we need some ordnance. Checkpoint. Ordnance no, means loot. Courtyard is clear. Over. <coughs> Head for the main gate to the east. I'll brief you as you go. Sword control. I see a target located. Uh, Any artillery support in the area? Yeah. Limited, but we'll prioritize whatever you need. <laughs> <laughs> Everything comes in twos. <laughs> Wait, did you get one too? No. So it came in twos. Crew Echo 57, headed back to base. But we've got yeah. enemy tangles on our six. Uh, yeah. How copy? Move six. Huh? Look 
has an anti-air battery that will help clear the skies. That's too late, It's a gunner. Thank you. Did you get it? Did we get it? Yeah, it's on the gun right there. Let's roll. Tell me 
see your gunner has aimbot? <laughs> Yo, he's shooting the body. Did you see that? He's shooting bodies, dude. You guys are fucking stud. This guy, give him a, give him a smart navigation, bro. Hope that comms array has a working generator. Let's pick a period for Jerry. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, he's dead. Michael, the right dead. Damn, I guess you're uh, you're Caesar if you're Rogue. Fucking flipped over. <laughs> there's a there's a ghost thing there. I guess I'll take it. This thing is fucking overpowered. <laughs> Damn. There goes my uh We're stalled in a solid A field. Cat, what are you? There's an aimbot. There's an aimbot. I guess I'm bored. I'm pretty sure you can drive over these. Oh, you definitely can. Oh, wait, not this. Oh, with the ghost, yeah. Yeah. Wait, weren't we just here? Oh, with the awesome warthog. Very similar. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get this over. Oh. Oh. 
What? Ow. Maybe if you drive up on this. On the <laughs> ghost? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. I'm gonna break the system mode. What? Okay, I'm back what can up. I do for you, Spartan? Take it out in a single map round. <laughs> we both got hit by it. There's one in the garage. I doubt that very much. No, I backed. Back. You backed. I backed over you. Yeah, I backed over you. I'm responsible at all. Someone backed over me. Keep putting Run to get it and hold the achievement. Base. Kill a thousand grunts. Let's go, boys. To the top of the base. Yo, this map. I remember this map on multiplayer. Over here. Six. Add up stairs in the system meal. George, oh. make sure he gets There's like a grab lift in the middle. And there's like a little cubby up top. Dude, I, yeah. I'm in. I still have the I'm sorry. Corvette's gonna rip this base apart. What's the situation? Oh shit, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't do this on my own! Need another Spartan up here! Uh, Six, get to the top floor and assist the meal! I died. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Does that mean, okay, but can I pick my armor lock? I don't Got it. There's, there's some yeah, garage carriage. Let's do this. Your rocket launcher's delivery. I want it. 
though. Uh, depends on what we try. We need those long swords in the air. Over the edge. I guess. Yeah. I was going to. There's a rocket launcher right here. This will do. Swords are inbound and ready to push. Oh, Orbital defense is standing by to take the shot. Get down to the science wing. Dr. Halsey wants to debrief the command thing. We're all hers. Repeat. Sounded like you said Halsey. I did. Copy that on our way. Don't need command to tell me. Been on hers half my life. I requested your assistance, Commander, and do not need a report on events that occur on my own doorstep. What I do require is a detailed account of your previous engagement. George, it's been too long. Mom. What have you done with my armor? Just some additions I've made. Indeed. Visegrad Relay. Its data center was home to one of my Xeno archaeologists, Professor Laszlo Sorvad. Perhaps Sorvad. you could shed some light on his Sorvad. death. If he was so a civilian like, male in his like, mid-60s, like, he died with the Covenant energy sword through his abdomen. Elites, then. They engaged us as well. It was just, uh, just after we found your scientist's daughter, Mom. She was hiding in the... Irrelevant. Uh, the elites. <laughs> Tell me more about Irrelevant. them. Three. Zealot class. One got bias. The leader, from the looks of him. Zealots. You're certain? Their armor configuration matched. Shield strength, too. I gave the order not to pursue. 
Our primary objective was to get the station's relay back online. Your primary objective? Commander, are you a puppet or a Spartan? Ma'am? There are those at Oni, myself included, who believe the Covenant dispatch elite advanced teams to hunt down artifacts of value to their religion. Survivor accounts suggests such teams are small, nimble, and almost always zealot class. No doubt they came to the station for the abundance of Oni excavation data stored there. And you let them get away. Data retrieval was not a command directive. Even had we known, we had other more urgent matters to attend to. Like warning the planet. Professor Sorvad's final entry in his field notes made reference to a latchkey discovery. Latchkey. Not a word he would use lightly. So let's hope that the data module your lieutenant commander stole contains it. Cat. Before you ask, I was alerted at the moment you attempted to access its contents, as I am with any unauthorized tap. That data is classified Tier 1. I could send you to the brig for interfering with my work. Maybe you'd like to join her. I'm sorry? We're currently under emergency planetary directive. Winter contingency? I'm sure you're familiar with the punishment for civilian interference with the Spartan deployment. Are you threatening me, Commander? Just making a reading suggestion, ma'am. Let's move, noble team. Is she in quarantine? Or she's in prison, um, she? That will uh, be all, George. I thought it was like a hologram, but I guess I don't know. Alright guys, that's going to do it for episode 2 in the series. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to give it a like. And as always guys, have a great rest of your day.